there is a healthy tension, great expectation building in the lead up to kick off here. A little bit grey overhead, and indeed the forecast is for a drop or two of rain as the day grows older. But regardless of that, there is a lovely backdrop here. The ambience is good, smashing noise from both sets of supporters, and expectations high in both camps. It is a venue, this, which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Well, this will certainly be a stern test of resolve. These are opponents for whom winning comes so easily. Well, this is the team you'd prefer to avoid, Peter, but it can be approached with a different psychological stance, meaning their run has to come to an end, so why not here? And if we did just miss it, we are up and running already. That intervention was very necessary. Sermon. Cook. Bournemouth were imperious when the two sides last met. And the fans are asking for more of the same. Popper. Andreas Pereira. Bournemouth, whose last result owes so much to the astuteness of their manager. He's a manager who understands how important the bench can be and the timing of substitutions. If needed, he's quick to make changes, and I just think he has more than a plan B. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Andreas Pereira. He's got away with one there. Well, it was just some wayward passing that let the opposition in then. And I have to say, a very lucky escape. You lose it there, you expect to be punished. And that's been one straight back. Quick glance at goal. Has a goal! Oh, and for a moment, time stood still. He's a clever pass. Oh, he's caught him there. It's a free kick. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Okay. And that is as far as they're going to go. Could be a chance here. Smith. Smith plays it towards the front. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. He's made sure that that won't get through. Smith. Approaching the half hour mark. If you have just joined us, well, you've missed no goals. Fraser! Yes, he are the man. And that kind of mode. Displaying his defensive capabilities uh, there. No strikers tackle. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Okay. Chance to shoot. And shoot! Goal! Oh, whose goal is that? Big deflection. That's one for the dubious goals panel. My goal.
Bournemouth take the lead. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Sermon. Manchester United are being made to look rather ordinary by their own lofty standards, aren't they? I think this all stems back to the last time the teams met. They lost by surrendering a lead to opponents. They should have probably beaten them. That tends to stick in the mind a bit. It's come loose. <laughs> Neither side really getting hold of the ball. One, 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 it? Out to the right. Smith pumps it into the area. That's not going to make it. Tries a shot! Oh, that is rather wayward. Maguire. Maguire. And the first 45 minutes are up. So there you have it, the sport half of football, but still had its moments, and ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Not the most convincing of displays, they could certainly do much better than this. They want to keep things simple, build up their confidence, and not <laughs> rush into the Here we go again. Manchester United don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. And out to safety. <laughs> and it's Lingard. Bruno Fernandes. Big chance! Oh, oh that is very close. Oh, that's a great effort. There was very little back there to indicate what was coming. <clears throat> King Maguire sticks in a foot to win it back Smith Sermon, Cook, Juan Bissaka tries to get it forward quickly. Cook, Smith, and it's played forward. Gosling hoists it forward. Maguire goes looking. Bruno Fernandes. And here's Martial. Sermon. Pogba. Rashford, Lingard, Manchester United have a free kick. Well, this is a very real chance, and should it go in, it could be a big... Martial! <laughs> Decent hit from there. And I don't that. And it's King. Gosling set up his side's equaliser in their last game. Gosling was alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Has a hit! In it goes! Oof. Well, it certainly livened things up a bit. That next goal now is absolutely crucial.
Yeah, the pass was bang on, and he just had to ensure he didn't stray offside. The finish was actually bang on too. Bournemouth can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Manchester United grab the equaliser, and we're all square. Well, I think this is a case of anything you can do, we can do too. I mean, they're matching each other like for like here. King, and here's Wilson. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Both sides a bit lacking in intent. He's looking unstoppable here. Fraser. And he's there to cut it out. Fraser. Lingard gets it back. Bruno Fernandes, who was a starter in the last game. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Lerma. Bournemouth showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. And here's Martial. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some air. <laughs> Bournemouth get it back again. Gosling gets it. Up. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. And it's Rashford. Manchester United merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. King. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. He is going into that little black book. Sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Time is ticking away, and they're playing as if they're defending a lead. They've got to get it up the pitch. He's picked him out. That's good defending, very good defending. Goes down, but nothing given. Looking to win it with time against them. Sermon just brushed off the ball there. Pogba plays it forward. Forward it goes. And in time is up. And there goes the whistle. A game chock full of moments and talking points. It could have gone either way. But chose in the end to share its spoils. It ends in a highly entertaining draw. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, if this was a game where both sides played...